how to install the Arturia Mini V presets included in Audio Tense Elastic Deluxe release. So with the product downloaded, head to the folder where you've stored it. Double click on the Audio Tent icon. If you head over to information, you'll find information on the release, the licensing agreement, and how to install the presets. Double click on the JPEG, and this will provide full instructions for installing your patches. I'm gonna take you through the steps included in this JPEG during this tutorial. Just a quick note before we continue. Before you try to install the patches, make sure that you're using the version of Mini V that you can see here on the screen or higher. For this tutorial, we'll use Ableton Live, but the patches will work with Mini V in any other door. Open up your door, head over to your plugins folder, find Mini V. Double click to load the plugin. Go to the Mini V icon on the top left hand corner of the user interface. Open the drop down menu and select Import. Go to the file location where you've stored your Audio 10 Elastic Deluxe release. Locate the Mini V presets. Select Audio 10 Elastic Mini X. Hit Open. You should get a notification saying the presets were imported successfully, like you can see here. Select OK. Go to the Options menu on Mini V. This will open your library. Head down to where your banks are stored. Click on Audio Tent Elastic and you'll see the Audio Tent patches. You'll know that you've got an Audio Tent patch because it will say AT at the beginning of the file name. Select your patch, double click. Load the sound and happy producing. If you have any problems at all with the presets output in white noise, we have a solution for that. Now we've included also in the release the individual patches. So if you go to your Audio Tent download, select Mini V presets, copy the folder that says Audio Tent Elastic, and this is where the patches are kept. Now if you're on a Mac, head over to your operating system, select Library, Arturia, Presets, Mini V user. Now open the user folder, delete any other versions to save confusion, paste the Mini V presets into your user folder, and now your Mini V presets will work. If you're a PC user, follow the same steps, but head over to your user folder within your Arturia presets by following the path on the screen here. Now if we reload the plugin, you should find your audio tent patches in the bank section within Mini V. Thanks for watching.